Here's my impression of someone skydiving. I love you, peanut butter. Yes, I do, peanut butter. I love you. Come over here. I love you, my dear. Everybody knows McDonald's famous slogan. <laughs> Well, they're finally changing it after 20, 30 years. And the new one goes like this. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. The food is so good here! You ever been to Foot Locker? I mean, come on, Foot Locker? What a horrible name for a restaurant. What's up? I just stopped at the 7-Eleven on Snyder and 10th to try and get some Cheetos and Doritos for my MF Doom nachos. And guess what? I show up there and I'm looking at their chip section. They don't have regular Cheetos. They just, all they have at the 7-Eleven is flaming Hot Cheetos and Cheddar Jalapeno Cheetos. Okay, I, I don't like those kinds of Cheetos. What don't you understand about this? I drove 20 minutes to get to the 7-Eleven. For nothing. For nothing. It's embarrassing. It's embarrassing. You should be ashamed to call yourself a 7-Eleven. A They're going to pay for this with their own blood. <laughs> <laughs> What's he doing there? What's he doing there? Who let him drive the car? Beep beep, rough rough. <laughs> Ruff, ruff. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me, sir. Do you know how fast you were going? Ruff, ruff. <laughs> Look, you might be a good boy, but no way you're a good driver. <sighs> Dogs should not be driving cars. This is a conversation I overheard between two women at the grocery store. Hey, do you want chips? 
Oh my God, we should get chips and get high. All right. Hey guys, I've got some bad news to share with you today. Uh, not to be alarming, but I... The thing they don't teach you in school about Abraham Lincoln's assassination. We all know Lincoln was shot at Ford's Theater. What they don't tell you is that Ford's Theater was actually a strip club. That's right, Lincoln died doing what he loved most, staring at tits and ass. My man. I went to the grocery store to get some bread. When I was checking out, the cashier scanned the bread and then put it back behind the counter. Wait, I wanted that. Sorry, I think you've had enough bread. Okay, fine. Just forget about it. And I left the store. As I was leaving, I heard the cashier say, Hey, wait a minute. I turned around and went back over. But then she just handed the bread to me. And I was like, I already told you I don't need it. I just wanted to make sure you got your bread. Okay, fine. I'll take the bread, but I'm not paying for it. That's fine. So I left the store with my free bread, and I was feeling pretty good about myself until I got home and realized I left my car in the parking lot. So I had to walk all the way back to the store to get it. The cashier was still there, so I was like, hey, can you just give me my car too? I don't really feel like walking home. Sure, no problem. So she went into the parking lot and brought my car over to me. I was so grateful that I gave the cashier a hug. Then I got in my car and drove home. Are you watching the birds? Oh, of course. I'm so old, I remember when they were called the Eagles. I like Eagles too. <laughs> no, Eagles. Everybody all over the world knows that Philadelphia loves the, I'm going to say it, the Eagles. We used to be mocked. They can't even pronounce the name of the, well, come to Philadelphia and learn the Philadelphia accent. I but, think that in Philadelphia, they get to choose how it's pronounced, right? right. It's, their, oh, yeah. it's their bird. Have a blessed day. Be safe. Don't be up after dark. Everyone's heard the story about when George Washington chopped down his father's cherry tree. He chopped it down, and when his father asked him, Did, uh, did you, it, uh, George, George, it's me, uh, <clears throat> it's me, your dad. Did you chop down my cherry tree? Tell me, George, did you do it? Don't lie to me. George replied, Daddy, I did chop down your cherry tree. I cannot tell a lie. But the part nobody knows is why he chopped down his father's cherry tree in the first place. <clears throat> George Washington chopped down his father's cherry tree so he could turn it into a pipe and use it to smoke weed and get high. My man. <laughs>